prior to the mid-1980s, RFDS aircraft were all piston engines. The introduction of the twin-engined King Air B200Cs in the late 1980s and the Pilatus PC-12s of the mid-1990s show the great benefits of turboprop aircraft. The first aircraft, the de Havilland DH-50, could carry a pilot and four passengers at a cruising speed of 129 kilometers per hour for a range of 500 to 600 miles. The Pilatus PC-12 of today can carry a pilot, one neonatal retrieval unit, plus one stretcher and four sitting persons and cruises at 450 kilometers per hour for a range of 3,320 kilometers. Today, the RFDS flies more than 25 million kilometres to provide the finest care to more than 275,000 Australians. That's one person every two minutes.